Yvonne Orji is an Emmy-nominated actress, writer, and comedian who is not afraid to tell it like it is. She's also an author, and her book, Bamboozled by Jesus, How God Tricked Me into the Life of My Dreams, <laughs> is out now in paperback. Hey, we're so happy you're here. I'm so happy to be here. And you've been busy, girl. Were you at the Open? I was at the U.S. Stop Open. Stop it! You just watched Coco? I watched Coco when I cry. we cried. We cried. We cried. cried. Oh, oh yeah, wait, yes. did they put, they put you on the big oh, jumbo? Yes. Did they put you on the jumbo? No. no. Yes, they did. I wasn't with Yvonne or the, Yes, they did. Did they put you on the jumbo? <laughs> you don't need to be with me to be on the big screen. Yvonne, tell, tell us about what witnessing that moment was like. First of all, so it was me, the Nye, um, Quinta, yes. Coco Jones. Like, we were all there. And once she, like, hit the floor, we yeah, we were all, yeah. we were like, yes, yes. The Nye, like, knocked my phone. I was like, girl, hold on one second. And so we just hugged, we cried, and we just, like, were in awe. She's 19. Like, look at us. We were what all having a good time. What a beautiful, beautiful moment to witness, right? Can you imagine, like, she saw Serena as such a young girl and was like, you're my idol. And, and then, then it's like, oh, I just won the same title you yeah. did. Yeah. I mean, they, you guys spoke with her this morning, and, and it's interesting. You said everything happens right on time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We know that your path to where you are now was Oof. not necessarily easy. No. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like everything happened for you right on time? I think it happened exactly how it was supposed to happen. You mm -hmm. know, I, I so most people who want to be an actor or a comedian, what they start very early. I got two degrees under my belt that yeah. had nothing to do with <laughs> entertainment. And then at 25, I was like, let me give this a go. Mm -hmm. And then I didn't pop till I was 31. And and, you know, my Nigerian parents were like, it's so late doing this thing you want to do. And I was like, I feel like I got time. I feel like, you know. Were you, did you think it was patience or did you believe, you know, that this could actually happen for you? I think you have to believe. Like, you, yeah. like if you don't believe, then you get exactly what you believe, right? Like, yeah. whatever you, like, you believe something, either it's going to work out or it's not. Whatever that belief is, that's yeah. exactly the path you're going to go on. I think for me, I was just like, between my Nigerian culture of like, Nigerian, they carry last. Like, we don't finish yeah. second. And then, like, faith of like, all things are possible. Yeah. I think I just rode the wave of those two, like, deep sentiments. And I was just like, all right, God, it's me and you rocking this thing out. <laughs> if it don't work out, it's, I'm blaming you. Like, yeah. <laughs> you know what? That's like one of the, one of the other sort of through lines of all of these incredible women. You look mm -hmm. at Coco, she immediately got down mm -hmm. on her knees and prayed. Yeah, she did. Girl. And it's also like how God, you know, mm -hmm. sees you. In yes. your life and how you see him or they or whatever, you yes, know? Yes, yes. How, how, is, how has he carried you throughout your life? Because here's the reality. It, is, it does get hard. Like, there is no guarantees. There's, like, I mean, for tennis, there's kind of like a pathway. It's like, mm -hmm. hey, you know, do this, get into this um, camp and train and get with these coaches. And then you can, you can maybe um, go pro. With com comedy, there's no, <laughs> there is no blueprint. Yeah. Acting, even acting, even people who do go to the school, that doesn't mean that they're going to make it. So for me, it was like, I didn't even know this was a job. I'm mm -hmm. coming at this super green, a little bit older. What is the pathway? And I really did have to believe that God, t I heard what I, what he said. Cause you know, that was the other thing. My, I was like, mom, dad, you know, God told me. And they were like, God. <laughs> so he doesn't talk to us. I was like, well, I don't know what he's saying to y'all, but this is what he told me. <laughs> <laughs> and so I had to like really believe. I was like, either he's lying or, I, you know. And sometimes I, you wonder for all of us, I think it's like, is that God or is that just me willing myself? Because sometimes you want to yes. be very clear, but you're obviously very clear. And what's funny about life too is, you, you're at this st stage in your life, but deep down inside, we are all who we were. Yes. Yeah. And yes. that includes like when you are thrifty and you count your yeah, totally. coins, that does not change because you have more coins. No, I'm still like, I knew that something great had to come out of my life. I came out of the womb holding my mama's IUD. So, you know what I mean? Like, I was like, y'all trying to keep me out? Like, I'm here. <laughs> so everybody who has an IUD, I'm sorry, girl. I don't know what to tell you. I hope it works. Uh, <laughs> Wait, are you kidding here? No, I seriously, I, I, they delivered me and I was holding my mom's IUD in my hand. Holy moly. <laughs> I thought that I thought that Are was like, you like one the of those. second coming of Jesus. No. What is happening here? They tried to keep me out, and God was like, "Nah, not this one. I got plans for her." So, <laughs> wait. By the way, you did all of these crazy jobs. I mean, you yes. you, you were you like hosted what? like for example, you hosted a funeral. 
Yeah. yeah. So before I like could really get onto clubs doing comedy, I was just hosting anything with a mic. If you had a <laughs> wedding, I was the ultimate hype woman at your at your ceremony. I hosted a, a wedding, baby shower, a funeral. Wait, wait. Funeral. What does it look like to host a funeral? Well, it's a celebration. You know, <laughs> they live their good life. Um, <laughs> we thank God. Like you, know, like you just have to keep the party going. Hoda, Hoda always hosts weddings. I told her that if I die soon, I'd like her to okay, host my please funeral. Stop. Stop. You can no. wear this you, outfit and be oh my perfect. God. Okay. You can totally do it. I mean, who else knows her better than you? Wait, we, we have to talk about your TED yes. Talk. Yes. Okay. This is what it's called. The weight is sexy. Mm -hmm. And it's about waiting yes. to give up your virginity until marriage. Yes. Something probably almost unheard of. I mean, I think it's heard of in different yeah. places. Yeah. 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 <laughs> like, it's not super unheard of, but yeah. And it was just that thing of like, I think sometimes when people are doing that, they feel like ashamed or they yeah. feel like, oh. yeah. I don't know, like, you know, and I was like, nah, it's sexy. Like, who else look like me? Okay. <laughs> uh, like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what they teach you in your church, but, you know, I think there's this idea of like, you can be empowered whatever you choose. For me, totally. it's really about everyone has a personal choice. Everyone does it. I wouldn't even recommend anybody to choose, you know, the path that I'm going. Your... But it's mine, and it's like, if I'm going to own it, I'm going to rock it, and I'm going to look sexy doing it, baby. Yes. You know this is fast. And Check wait, out I... that TED Talk, by the yeah. way, 2017. And are you dating right now? I mean, I'm. you were supposed to look me up the last time I was oh here. Oh, my God, that's right. You, what? We you... got busy. Jenna, let's get on it together. Ma'am. I did not forget. Okay, what boss. are you into? you got to tell me. I, first of all, the she fact that you asked her and no. not me. You here. That's well, right. Wait, you know what? I have to say, she sets up very well. Oh. That's what she does. Oh, she actually talking? has a marriage set up with I a friend I have one of marriage, but I'd like to get belt. two more because I heard if you get three in the Jewish faith, you go straight to heaven. Well, listen, if you get the second one in the Nigerian faith, you're going to go straight to the village and there's going to be a cow and a goat. A cow. My mama will thank you personally, okay? <laughs> you can find Bamboozled by Jesus on today.com slash books. Thanks, Oh, my gosh. We love you. Come so back fun. and see us. Thank you. Okay.